mai i Pōtiki Rua ki te toka a Taiau. Tere iho ki ngā tuke mata o ka hunganu. Ngā reo irirangi o te rāwhiti. Tama tū, tama ora, tama noho, tama mate, tama hia inu, me inu i te kapitai rāwhiti. Your reason to wake up nice and early, brought to you by Tūranga FM, Radio Ngāti Pro and Radio Kahunganu. Well, we already get up nice and early for our Tūranga Health Parakuihi show, eh, Ra? Yes, we do. It's a little too early. But kids love the sleep-ins and they won't be sleeping in if they're on the Te Waka Maia course. Now, Te Waka Maia is an eight-week course open to year 10 to 13 students at Flaxmere College in Hastings. It entails three training sessions a week, all starting before 6am, we know what that's like. It culminates in the longest day. Which is a gruelling eight hour non-stop 30 kilometre urban run through Napier carrying a tyre and a pole as well as 20 litre cans. I'm already tired. Goodness me. Radio Kahunga News Rahina Huata has that story, but first, here's the news. Te tai rāwhiti me Tūranga Nui a Kiwa Toko Toru o te hunga prihi mana hou te kauma whetu te toko maha ka tau atu ki konei i te pikinga o ngā prihi mana o te motu mo ngā take hapori kenge anō hoki. Hei tā te kai kō mihana prihi mana, hei tā Andrew Costa. Rima rau ngā prihi mana hou ka whakangungu mō te mahi, whai muri ngā mohini hou o te tahua pūtia rua mano rua te kauma whā i whakataha hia. Ki kahungunu i nae nei, whai muri mai ngā matapaki ngā kōrero, kua mana te kupu, ka kati ngā tatau ki te puna wai koukou o Frimley. Nā te nui ngā mahi me te nui hoki o te pūtia, ke whakahaere tonutia te puna wai koukou nei, e hara tēnei i te paitawhiti mō here taunga, ahakua he tino wāhi tēnei ki ngā whānau. A kāti, koira ngā kōrero o te wā. Te Whaka Maia is a programme of physical and mental training development designed to extend a young person's mind and physical capability. Radio Kahunga News Rahina Huata spoke to senior constable and the head boy of Flaxmere College about Te Whaka Maia. A kāti, kia mā takitaki, a ki tātou. No mai hoki mai rā e te iwi ki te wahanga parakuhi. Joining me in the studio this morning is Constable Shea and Flaxmere College head boy uh, to talk about the incredible Te Waka Maia program. Can you tell us about Te Waka Maia program please? Sure can. Uh, the Te Waka Maia program, well, currently we're doing it at Flaxmere College but it's an eight week program um, which runs every Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Uh, with students, we've got about 25 students from Makura and um, adults, support staff, uh, which are police, um, teachers and whanau come along and we train for an hour uh, from 6.30 to 7.30. It's uh, hard work, it's not for the faint-hearted. Um, <laughs> we work hard, we train hard, uh, but that's the expectations and the students know they're heading into it, so um, yeah, it's a really good program. Yeah, I mean the um, Tawira have to be quite resilient considering it's been some frosty mornings out there. <laughs> what inspired the police to get involved in a program like this? I guess for police and for me, it's just a real good opportunity for me to um, build good relationships with the students, uh, the whanau and the wider community in a really, really positive way. Um, yeah, and just a good chance to meet lots of new faces and yeah, it's, that's really, really good for me. Don't worry, that's awesome. How have you seen the students grow or change throughout the program? Yeah, that's probably the, um, the biggest part of the program really and the reason I keep coming back and being involved is you just see um, the students get more confident. You can just see that the students that right at the beginning, they didn't think they were capable of doing what is required for Te Whaka Maia and, and maybe we were a little bit unsure whether they were as well. Mm. Just seeing them go from week one through to week eight and just that sort of mental and physical sort of growth they undergo, you, you just, it just changes them and they they walk a bit taller and, and you just see massive growth in their confidence. Oh, that's awesome. Kahuri kia koe wha Apache. What motivated you to join um, the Te Waka Maia program? About three years ago, I was on the sidelines. I was supporting all of all of our whānau, all of our tawira and all of our kaiako. From the sidelines, I was, you know, I was shuttling through on the van, cheering <laughs> them on out the window. Um, and that's what made me join, was seeing how hard they were pushing. So I joined, I joined up the, the following, uh, the next year, and I was the first uh, 
grab a paper and the first assignment. Tēnā koe Iera, would you recommend this programme to other students? I would. I would recommend it 100 percent to other students, not just of my kura, but of the kura kaipapa, or any other kura that would love to come and do it. I would recommend it. Hard out. <laughs> Thank you both for coming in and sharing the corridor about this awesome program. Uh, feeling a little bit inspired over here. Hoi ano. <laughs> we'll just leave it there. Tēnā kōrua. Karawe. Now next week on Kapu Tai Rafati, we talk to artist and Gisborne District Councillor Nick Tupara about the new Waka Walkway here in Tūranga. But until then... E te tī, e te tā. Hey, hey Kona! Just send... to the peace sign. <laughs> Can you see my calluses? <laughs> Ringa rau pa, ake nei.